Hi my friends, this is James with Dreamscapes. I want to give you a quick video tour of our plants over here at our Simi Valley Pondless Water Feature Project. So this is a scented geranium here, it's a nutmeg geranium. We have a combination of whimsical plants and, and non-natives, but then we also have a lot of drought tolerant and California native plants. For example, we have Anigazanthos, kangaroo paw, we have calendrinias, we have a um, butterfly bush, or milkweed, see where it gets its name from, Asclepias tuberosa. We have a lot of Ceanothus here. Uh, Yankee points are gonna crawl downwards, wild uh, California iris. For our edge, we always put in some pelagonum, uh, uh, poly, poly, polygonum, excuse me, that's a pink clover. Um, elephants here in the middle with a carax. So let's take a quick tour and see what things look like when the water feature is not roaring and rushing. And we can focus on the plants. We have a lot of Zauschnera in here as well. Everything really has just come together like a postcard. Uh, most of these plants are beloved by hummingbirds and butterflies, of course. But you see how our plants are sort of dressing up and filling in the borders so beautifully. And you're only really seeing the stones we want you to. Character boulders and our bench. I have uh, Arctostaphylus. We have Manzanita in here. We have a little mini black pine in here, a little black pine tree that's eventually going to grow and curve. Um, and of course, we have our more polygonum and a trait of scantia by our, our water window there. So out here we have very drought tolerant, tolerant Arctostaphylus. These are all being watered by a drip system. Here's the salvia hot lips. Combination of salvia, coffee bush, different salvias. And then over here on the back side of the water feature, I'm pushing in some slightly different shrubs, like for example, we have um, Matilia poppy, Rumnia coltri. I even put a, a smoke bush here. We'll see how it does. Um, for our vines, we have our Cupa de Oro and a um, beautiful wild California grape. A lot of Ceanothus back in here. And our oak and just these beautiful shrubs. And these will eventually disguise the whole back of the waterfall. Thank you for joining me for this very long video as we've been exploring uh, drought tolerant, sun tolerant, and California native plants here in beautiful Simi Valley, California.